Leonardo's AW249 Finis, unveiled as a next-generation attack helicopter at the Paris Air Show on June 17, 2025, represents a monumental advancement in combat aviation, particularly through its sophisticated integration of diverse missile systems and its ability to carry advanced munitions, including during hover. Engineered to replace the Italian Army's aging AW129 Mangusta, the AW249 is a clean sheet design tailored for high intensity missions and modern battlefield demands. With a maximum takeoff weight of 8.3 tons and a mission payload capacity of up to 2.8 tons, the helicopter is powered by two General Electric CT78E6 turboshaft engines, each delivering approximately 2,500 shaft horsepower, ensuring exceptional performance in hot and high altitude environments. Its cutting-edge avionics suite featuring large-area multifunction displays, integrated helmet-mounted displays, and a robust mission computer facilitates advanced data fusion and manned-unmanned teaming, establishing the AW249 as a fully networked aerial asset. The airframe incorporates crash-worthy structures, stealth features, and a comprehensive survivability suite including infrared suppressors, radar warning receivers, laser threat detectors, and a fully integrated defensive aid suite, making it a formidable platform in contested environments. The AW49's development was initiated with a 487 million euros contract from the Italian Ministry of Defense in January 2017 aimed at delivering a more capable and survivable attack helicopter. Following its maiden flight in August 2022, four prototypes have been constructed, with two actively engaged in weapons integration and mission system testing. By 2028, Italy plans to induct at least 48 units, with 17 already secured under a 735 million euros contract for production and long-term support. The helicopter's agility and NATO interoperability were demonstrated during the Stella Alpina 2024 military exercise, where simulated combat operations confirmed its readiness for integration with allied assets. Leonardo's strategic vision positions the AW249 as a European response to evolving NATO and expeditionary requirements, offering a platform that combines modularity, precision firepower, and enhanced survivability. At the heart of the AW249's grades is its ability to integrate a diverse array of missile systems. Prominently showcased at the Paris Air Show 2025 with weaponry from Europe's leading manufacturers. The helicopter is equipped with the Thales MBDA FZ275 laser-guided rocket, a 70mm lightweight munition co-developed by Thales Belgium and MBDA, designed for close support strikes with minimal collateral damage. The MBDA Acheron LP, a long-range precision-guided missile, offers multi-target engagement capabilities, including anti-armor and fortified position strikes, with both fire-and-forget and, and man-in-the-loop modes. The MBDA Brimstone, a radar and laser-guided missile, excels at high-speed engagements of moving armored targets, renowned for its precision and low collateral effects. These missiles, combined with the AW249's capacity to carry up to 2.8 tons of munitions, provide unmatched flexibility compared to legacy platforms like the AH-1Z Viper or T-129 attack, which rely on less diversified systems such as the AGM-114 Hellfire or Roketsan's UMTAS. Armament integration began in November 2023, with tests focusing on the OTO Malara TM-197B 20mm cannon turret and progressed to include unguided 70mm rocket pods and mock-up armaments during demonstrations at Vergiate and Eurosatory 2024. A groundbreaking addition to the AW249's arsenal is its integration of loitering munitions, displayed at the Paris Air Show 2025 alongside its missile suite. These tubular launch systems, though not officially named, are designed for long-endurance surveillance and precision strikes offering capabilities similar to air-launched effects, like the U.S. Marine Corps' Red Wolf munitions. This integration enhances the AW249's multi-role potential, enabling it to deploy drones or guided munitions for reconnaissance, communication relay, or targeted strikes while hovering, a capability that distinguishes it from competitors. 
The helicopter's stub wings, designed for modularity, support a variety of configurations, allowing operators to tailor its loadout to specific mission profiles, from anti-armor operations to countering aerial threats with air-to-air -air missiles. The AW249's ability to carry such a diverse and modular weapon suite while maintaining hover capability underscores its transformative role in air-ground operations. Its compatibility with NATO standard munitions and emphasis on digital combat systems align with the shift toward network-centric warfare, manned-unmanned teaming, and joint operational interoperability. Leonardo's partnerships with MBDA and Thales strengthen the AW249's position as a hub for collaborative armament development in Europe. By integrating guided rockets, precision missiles, and loitering munitions, the AW249 offers unparalleled adaptability, enabling it to address a wide range of threat environments and tactical doctrines. Beyond its technical advancements, the AW249's upgrades reflect Italy's broader strategic ambitions. The helicopter strengthens Italy's autonomous high-intensity combat capability while reinforcing NATO's collective defense with a survivable, flexible, and interoperable platform. Its development aligns with Europe's push for technological sovereignty in defense, reducing reliance on non-European platforms. The AW249's ability to hover while deploying munitions, particularly loitering systems, enhances its battlefield persistence, allowing it to maintain situational awareness and engage targets with precision in dynamic environments. This capability is particularly valuable in urban warfare or complex terrains, where sustained observation and rapid response are critical. Leonardo's focus on modularity extends to the AW249's potential export market, with interest from nations like Algeria, as noted in defense discussions. The helicopter's design accommodates future upgrades, such as enhanced electronic warfare systems or next-generation sensors, ensuring its relevance through the 2030s and beyond. Its open architecture mission systems facilitate integration with emerging technologies, positioning the AW249 as a future-proof platform. As the only European-built attack helicopter in active development, it offers allied nations a strategic alternative at a time when precision, survivability, and modularity are paramount. With ongoing testing and a clear path to operational deployment, the AW249 Finis is poised to redefine lethality and versatility in modern combat aviation, setting a new standard for attack helicopters worldwide.